Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, kids of all ages, welcome back to another episode of RB Plays All of Fabric 3. That's right, folks, we're back in our modded world doing all the cool modded things. My name is RB Plays. I am your humble host, your humble, humble host on this side of the screen. Thanks so much for stopping by. If this is your first time here, please do consider hitting that subscribe button and get notified every time we put new content up on the channel. So we just finished a live stream, like literally just finished a live stream, just signed off, just turned off all the music, just did all of the post uh, post Twitch live stream things. Don't forget, if you want to stop by and see a Twitch live stream, the link for that will be down in the doobly-doo. We stream every uh, every Wednesday, Saturday, and Sunday, and uh, the times are available on our uh, on our Twitch page. But we did a few things in the live stream. We built ourselves a uh, industrial centrifuge. We built ourselves a compressor. Uh, we also built ourselves a uh, one of these guys up here. Um, this is working swimmingly. We're we're getting a lot of lo a lot of oak. Uh, I've been manually bringing things back down there. I've got some information to share about that. Uh, but we made one of these things. We made a miner. I have no idea how to make this thing work. <laughs> uh, so I tried putting like pickaxe in there. I tried putting ores in there. I tried doing all of the things. I cannot figure out how to get this thing to actually start mining things. Um, there's supposed to be a book available. It doesn't seem to be available in. Uh, in this pack yet. Uh, that doesn't mean that it won't be, but right now I just, I can't figure it out. I can't seem to figure this out. So if anybody knows how to make this thing work, what I got to do to actually get it uh, to start mining and pulling in ores, because it's got power, right? I'm using the solar cell. It's got power and it's, it's doing fine, but it just, it doesn't seem to want to want to bring anything in. So if anybody knows how to make that work, I am all ears, literally cat ears. Uh, I am all ears and I would love to, uh, to understand how that thing works. Today, however, oh, the other thing that we did is we repaired our core of flight. Remember we had like four of these things. We had found them in different chests and sunken ships and dungeons and mine shafts and all that. Um, and so we had four of these and uh, we used, we, we built this stuff so that we could get a, uh, so we'd get a slime ball, right? Because slime, if you look up slime balls, you can get slime balls from an industrial centrifuge from magma creams. And we had a few magma creams from the one trip to the nether that we made. We still have a couple, We've still got uh, two left there. Um, so we threw the slime ball into the industrial centrifuge and we got ourselves a, uh, or our, a magma cream in there and got ourselves a slime ball. And then you just use the slime ball and a diamond to repair the core of flight. First thing we're gonna do today is we're gonna make a set of wings. So. The winged mod, W-I-N-G-E-D, winged mod, has a lot of different uh, has a lot of different um, wing patterns in here that you can use. Uh, what is this? Fried chicken. Ooh, we can make fried chicken, y'all. We might be making some fried chicken. Um, so we can make fried chicken. We can also make all kinds of different wings. Uh, prismarine cape wings. Can't really do that because I don't think we have a lot of prismarine. We could do these. Uh, these Enderman eye looking wings. That's from Minecon 2016. Uh, so it just needs black wool and it needs a, a faux con attendee ticket. Looks real enough to me. Nobody will care to look it up, right? So you just create that with a piece of paper, a piece of gold, and a piece of black dye, which I think, I think we should be able to pull off. We're in the, we're in, we're, we're near the ocean. And so having black dye shouldn't be all that complicated. Uh, and I think I have some wool. Do I have wool? I had access to sheep. I have wool. Hmm. 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 Wool? Bring it. Wool. Don't see any wool in there. Don't see any wool in there. Don't see any wool in there. So we're going to have to find some wool if we want to do this. Which is fine, we can definitely do that. Or actually, can we just make wool? Probably can make wool, can't we? Because um, we might have, we might be able to find some string. We have string over at the mob farm. Um, or the other the other ones that we could do is uh, at winged. I mean, it's definitely not how you spell at winged. At winged, what can we, what else can we do? So, Minecon 2019 cape, uh, the cobalt cape. These are elytras. I don't want to do the elytras. Uh, Brazil wings. Like, I want to find the, like, the least... I mean, these 2016 cape wings, these are pretty cool. And black wool would be would be all right. Oh, you know where we can get some wool from? I'm going to show you where we can get some wool from. We can get some wool from right over... Right over... Right 
right out over that way, I think. Zoom out there. Oh, oh did I change my render distance? Setting render distance? No. Put that to 16 so we can actually see what's going on out there in the world. Back to game. There are boats around here, you know. And wherever there are boats, there are sails. And wherever there are sails, there is, uh, there's wool. So let me go find some wool real quick. We'll come back, we'll put our cape on, and we'll get ourselves, uh, we'll get ourselves some flight. And then we're going to work on the automations that we're going to need to get the sand, to make the sandstone, to get this pyramid up and running. So we'll be right back. Okay, so we got all the stuff that we're going to need. We do need to get some uh, of this and some of that. So we need uh, four, we need six pieces all together. We found two pieces of black wool, so we'll get four more. That'll give us the six that we need. Then we need one of these, uh, these faux tickets, faux con tickets. So we just need a piece of paper, a gold nugget, and another piece of black dye, which we have, because I killed some squids on the way back. Uh, so we need a piece of paper. Oops, paper. Uh, do I have any paper made already? Say the answer to that is probably no. But, uh, so let's get some of one, two, oh, one. Uh, let's get some of you. Let's turn you in to get a piece of nugget which is here. Those. So now we should be able to make that ticket. Yes, please. Yes, please. Ticket, please. Thank you. And then, uh, and then wings. Can we make the wings? We can make the wings. So basically, what this amounts to now is a p is a pair of elytra, um, and uh, and and we can mount those. So these do not they don't have to go here, right? They don't take an inventory slot. Uh, they don't fit up here at all. Basically, you just equip them. I don't know if you can ever take them off, but you put them on, and then you basically have a pair of permanent elytra uh, on your body. So let's uh, I guess I guess let's. We, uh, and they don't take durability either, from what I understand. So I guess we'll just equip it. Look at that. So F5. Oh, dude. Yeah. Yeah, that was a good choice. Okay. So now, me and my, me and my, me and my cat ears. Uh, now let's go over here because this is the highest place that we have, right? So let's see uh, what this does as far as allowing us to glide a little bit, right? I'm not super interested in having creative flight because this could this could be bad, but we're gonna give it a shot. We are flying high. We're gliding and flying high, and I love it. That's awesome. Dudes, that's cool. Okay, I'm I'm happy. We've got gliding flight now, and there's also something else that we can make. Uh, so from the winged mod. No, it's not winged, it's from trinkets. So it's a trinket. At trinket, yeah, this thing. Uh, we can make the aglet, uh, the rocket aglet. So the rocket aglet a lot needs iron ingots, a diamond, a piece of TNT, and a firework rocket. Um, and then that means that you don't have to have rockets. You can just fly, which is kind of cool. It, so it will again, it won't be creative flight, but you'll be able to you'll be able to fly just like if you had rockets in vanilla, right? So I think I have some TNT that I picked up someplace. I do. Got some of that. We need some of you. Uh, yeah, let's grab that. And we also need some paper. Uh, we need to make a little bit more paper, right? I think maybe. See? We might need a little bit more paper. So let's get that. That and that and do that. And then make, oops, make... Okay, so you don't have a recipe. Uh, firework rocket. That, this. Firework rocket, flight duration one. Let's try it. That, just need, okay, so I got that and then I got that. So I just need some iron and some, uh, and some diamond. So one diamond and then some iron, be enough, done, 
Oh, firework rocket? Yeah! So that is the rocket aglet, and that allows us to fly without rockets, yeah? I don't know how this works, but we're going to give it a shot. Apparently we got to do this. Oh, this is too cool, y'all. This is too cool. It's kind of cheaty, I know, but doggone it, it's nice. All right, so let me uh, let me do the whole flying around thing, and uh, I'll come back to you guys in just a minute, back at the base, and we'll work on the next project. Because I'm having too much fun. This is awesome. Okay, so the next thing that I want to do today is I want to get going on a some kind of cobblestone generator slash sand generator so that I can make a bunch of sandstone so that we can work on our pyramid, right? So what I'm thinking is we've got this mod in here called uh, uh, called Industrial uh, Industrial Revolution, right? And in the, in the Industrial Revolution mod, there are these pulverizers. We'll have to make the Mark I for now because I don't think I have... I don't think I have all the stuff. You got to make these upgrades. So Mark II machine upgrade. That's just copper and a two circuit. And it takes nickelite and get. We might be able to do the the tier two one. I don't know. I want to get the tier one one, tier one one, the tier one uh, machine up and running to start with. Uh, but it takes quite a bit of different stuff, right? So we want. Uh, uh, and we also need to make a breaker. Uh, so the breaker that might also be from. Uh, that's from Astro Mine. So we need a lot of stuff for that. We need some of these basic circuits. We need a lot of iron plates. We need advanced machine case chassis, basic machine chassis, primitive machine chassis, which is a lot of different plates. Um, so what I need to do first is I need to get a bunch of plates going. Uh, how many plates do I think I'm going um, to get the primitive? The primitive needs copper plates and tin plates, four of each. So let's grab... Uh, let's grab four of you and then four of you, right? And we put in our uh, compressor. We made that in the live stream today. So we'll put that in there and that will uh, that will compress those down. We also have one machine upgrade. So let's grab that so that this runs just a little bit faster, hopefully faster enough that it will make a difference. We'll get those going and then to get the second tier, so that's the primitive. We take the primitive and we add bronze plates and iron plates. So we're going to need four iron plates and four bronze plates. Iron, one, two, three, four. And then bronze, I think, is just one, two, three copper and a tin. I put that in there. Three copper and a tin. And that should make bronze. I don't remember if that's going to make four bronze. I think it makes four bronze. And if it makes four bronze, then that should be enough for four plates, right? Um, yes, it does. Sweet. So that takes care of that. You're done. So that's cool. Get the tin plates going. And that will give us what we need to make the primitive. Then we'll get the iron and the bronze. That'll give us what we need to make the next tier. And then the third tier that we would need uh, is the, that's the basic, right? Yeah, so that's the basic. And then this one here is just, ooh, steel. How do we make steel? Steel plates. So steel from Tech Reborn in the blast furnace is small piles of iron, uh, refined iron ingots, and coal dust. Okay, we might be able to pull that off. I might need to go get some coal, but we might be able to pull that off. Uh, oh, you're you're struggling, struggling. You need to not struggle some uh, tin dust. Go ahead and do that over there. Oh, baby. Yeah, you're struggling a little bit. Um, that's unfortunate. All right, so I guess we'll have to do that. Do I have any coal? I should have some coal. Do. Uh, and then coal dust makes steel. Um, yeah, to make steel. Steel plates. Steel plates. Steel ingots. Blast furnace. That's refined iron and coal dust, and I need four coal dust, and it takes one one coal for one dust, so it's four. It's four coals. All right, so 
You go ahead and do your thing. You go ahead and do your thing. I'm going to let these guys do all of their compression type stuff and grindy type stuff. And uh, and we'll get to this point where we can make this block breaker. We're going to need we need a lot of plates, like a lot of plates. We could make some of them with the hammer from uh, from uh, from from Industrial Revolution. We could do that. I might end up doing that as well, so that we can save some power on this guy. But let me make up all these plates, and uh, and I'll come back to you guys in uh, in just a minute. Okay, so I've been processing plates for a while. I also processed some iron. Iron's pretty simple in this pack. You just need to make some iron blend, which is uh, powdered or pulverized iron and coal dust. And you mix the two of those together, you put them in a blast furnace, you get iron or steel ingots, or yeah, steel ingots. And then those need to be steel plates. So while those are cooking up those steel plates, let's go ahead and get going on uh, this block break, this block breaker thing. Uh, the breaker needs to have this uh, this basic primitive chassis. So let's go ahead and make a primitive chassis. And then from the primitive chassis, we should be able to make the basic chassis. Uh, wait a minute. What am I not? What do I not have? Oh, we need to make this. So oh, there's that. Okay. Then we need to go to the basic chassis, but that's where we need the steel from. So steel is cooking up right now. Halfway done. Um, while that's doing that, we'll, we'll go ahead and move on to... Hello, Windows. Why are you making noise on me? Um, we'll go into here and we'll de and we'll see about uh, what am I? Uh, what am I? What am I? Uh, we'll see about the pulverizer. So pulverizer. We can go ahead and get started on that. We just need one of these MK circuits. So those. We need uh, a frame. Let's go. Ahead. Block. Let's go ahead and do one of those. We need a battery. So let's go ahead and do one of those. And then we have to do. Yes, we just don't, no, we just need flint. Hello, flint. You got some flint for me up here? Yeah, you do. That's flint for me. Uh, flint, flint, and all. Oh. Ah, that's a bummer. I forgot that's how that works. It, it, it doesn't work. It doesn't want to shift click in, and that's fine. Um, we just need there and you there, and then a couple of you there and there, and that gives us, sweet, a Mark One. Pulverizer. This should be done. So we got steel frames. Yay. Uh, and then we go back to our breaker. So the block breaker, which is right there. We're trying to make this guy, right? There we are. So that's that. And ooh, new recipes. Uh, and then we just need to make one of you. Oh, that's fine. We need to make one of you. Oh. We need to make one of Two of you, as a matter of fact. Oh, we need some redstone. Uh, redstone. Redstone. One, two. That's three. Fine. That'll work. Uh, block breaker. You. Redstone. Oh, we only need. We only need to make one of them. Fine. That's okay. We'll make that work. I didn't realize that it made two of them. No big deal. No big deal. But there's a block breaker. Sweet. Now, does the block breaker require power? Yeah, it do. The block breaker do require require the power. Hmm. Um. That's unfortunate. Hold on one second here. I need to need to figure out how we're how we're gonna get power for that. Oh, I know how. I think I know how we're gonna get power for that. Just take Fe uh, or LF or whatever it is. I've got this. Yeah. Okay. So this makes LF. I made this to go with the tree farm up there a while back, and uh, and then we decided we didn't need it. So I think we're okay as far as having something that will. Uh, that will work. Uh, we do need to make some conduits, not some conduits, but some some cables. So let's go ahead and do that. And uh, nope, not like that. It's like this. That, yeah, three, three, three might be enough. I don't know. Let's go over here. Let's go over here to the uh, to the pyramid. I think we have everything we need. Uh, we've got our pocket crafting bench, so if we need to craft anything, we can. Uh, but I want to come over here, and I want to put the uh, the process that we're going to do inside of the pyramid. So what we're going to do is we're going to make a uh, we're going to make a block. Uh, we're going to make a, a lava generator, and we're going to make uh, a block breaker that's going to break that. Uh, the cobblestone, not a lava generator, cobblestone generator, and we're going to make a, we're going to use, use the block breaker to break the cobblestone. Uh, so if I put him, say, here, 
If I put him, say, here, that's the pulverizer. I don't want the pulverizer there. Oops. Uh, we want the block breaker. Right? And so if I put a piece of stone in front of you, I don't have any stone, do I? Blocks. I don't have any blocks on me. That's all right. I can just do this. Uh, done. Put that like that. We'll give him power. I'm going to go ahead and put this coal generator, say, so if I put him there, give him, I don't have any coal or charcoal, and it's almost time to sleep. Um, but if I put him here and then I put the pulverizer, say, down here, here like that then then we could use we could make it so that the lava generator or the cobblestone generator has lava feeding in from one side water feeding in from the other it'll make cobblestone and then uh, the block breaker will break the block we can use a hopper which I'm gonna have to craft a couple of hoppers up that's why I've got the extra iron and the extra uh, chests there but that should do the trick so let me go ahead and gather some some fuel from over there. We'll take a nap, we'll do some things, and I'll come back and we should have that thing put together. Okay, so I've got a little something going over here. I think it's gonna work. I think it's gonna be about how I want this to, to function. So uh, block breaker here, uh, a coal generator here, pulverizer here. Um, and what I'm thinking is if we put a water bucket, I had to go find some lava. So if I go put a water bucket there, uh, Apparently that's not right. <laughs> that's not what I want. That's not going to do the trick, laddie. Uh, F7. Okay, so F7. Oh, there are some. Yeah, so there are some. Be right about here-ish. Yeah. So put you there and you there and you there. Yeah. Yeah, okay. I know what I need. I know what I need. So you need to be, you need to be broken there and you... Yeah, that's what I want. Uh, and then right over here, if we take and put sandstone back like this, like this, like this. Uh, and then also we glass, stay right here. Uh, then we should be able to see what's going on back here. And if we put lava in here, yeah, buddy. That's uh, that's the ticket, laddie. And then we're going to go ahead and cover this up with glass because why not? Because we want to be able to see it, right? So with that, uh, and then we'll do this, like so, that like that, that like that, that like that. We'll put that there. Uh, we'll keep this open. Maybe we'll put a half slab or a, a trap door or something on top of that. Uh, but now we just need to get this thing powered up and hopefully it'll start power. Oh, baby, it does. And... Uh, are you, you doing the thing? Oh. oh, you're going in there. Oh, did I not output you from there? I thought I thought it would break it. It would break it there, and then it would be fine. So that's that's interesting. But you won't pull out. You won't pull out of there with a hopper. You even input into here hopper. Like if I were to take some of you out of here and put you like that, you do, but you don't output. Ah, energy items. Aha. So bottom output. Um, bottom input, bottom output. That worked. Did work. Why are you not getting power now? Because you should be getting power. You are getting power. Getting powder. Powder, you're getting power. Full generator, you're doing fine. See? Uh, not heated up. Pulverizer. What do I gotta do to up, Mr. Pulverizer? Input, output. I just want you to be output. There we go. Output. Cool. Yeah, you're just going to keep breaking those blocks, and you're going to keep doing that. That's awesome. You, on the other hand, you have issues. Oh, you are you are heating up now. Cool. Okay. Uh, what do I got to do to get you to 
the temperature that you need to be. Is it just going to take a while for you to get to the temperature? Hmm, this is intriguing. This is intriguing. Oh, it's nighttime. Uh, we need to sleep. <laughs> we really need to sleep. Yes, we do. Because there are mobs. Oh, and they are coming. No. Oh, no. Mobs. Good thing they can't get to me, yeah? Yeah. So you are... Ninety-eight degrees. Okay. Fifty items. Hundred and three degrees. So I guess it just keeps building temperature. Full potential. Not heated up. So I guess it just needs to get warmer, right? Once it gets warmer, then it should start turning that cobblestone into. Um, Start turning that cobblestone into uh, uh, sand, right? So let's let that do its thing for a second. I want to show you guys something. So we got the flight, right? Um, ooh, hello, creeper. Uh, so we got flight, but the that little aglet thing that we made, it definitely takes durability. So we got to be careful about that. Otherwise, we'll get stranded someplace. We may have to go ahead and make some more of those. And I'm wondering if the flight durability rockets make a difference. Because we just use flight durability... Our, our flight range one rockets to make this. So I'm wondering if we use the flight durability two rockets or three rockets, if that would make a difference. So you're full of cobblestone. You are heating up as far as temperature goes. I'm hoping that that's all you need. You're getting power. Hoping that you need. You're kind of doing the thing. Kind of doing the thing. I guess I'm going to let this heat up for a minute, and we'll, and I'll come back to you when I got something to show. Okay, so we're going to try one thing. I've been letting that thing go for a little while, and it keeps telling me that it's not heated up, that it needs to be a hotter temperature. And I'm wondering, I'm just wondering if maybe it needs uh, one of these machine upgrades. And so what I want to do is I want to make, uh, I want to make one of them. So let's get uh, uh, six of those. I think it's six. Uh, let's put those into here to turn those into those guys. We need to make one of these infusers. We're going to make the base level infuser. Uh, it needs um, so, um, uh, an iron plate for that. And then it also needs an iron plate, uh, some iron plates for this. So actually it needs one more of those. So let's grab one more piece of iron and throw that in there. Let's grab some tin. I'm going to need more compressors probably. Uh, we're finding it. There we go. So five of you. Um, and then uh, we also, so we need to make one of these, one of these mark one circuits or whatever it is. Oh, I got, I got tons of stuff in my inventory that's just driving me batty. Uh, you can go away. Uh, you can go away. You. Uh, these plates. I'm going to put these plates away because I don't need those. Well, I might need, I might need the copper one. Copper ones could come in handy, right? Yeah, copper ones will definitely come in handy there. But we need to make this infuser for this nickelite ingot. So uh, so that's the plan. That's what we're working on right now. Um, so give me these. Uh, and then we can do uh, one of these. I need one of you. Yes, please. Uh, then we can grab these guys. We've got one left. We'll need one more. Uh, what else can I make while I'm waiting on this thing to kind of... And to catch up with them here. So infuser mark one, we need glass, we've got that. Uh, we need a machine block. Uh, we'll be able to make that here in a second. Yep, come on. You know you want to hurry up there, homie. Ugh. The the struggle is real, right? Like I, I don't I think that's gotta get to a certain temperature, but I don't know if it if adding the upgrades will make it so that they don't need to get as hot, per se. Um I'm hoping that that's what that means. So we'll do that, we'll do that, and then that. That. That, nope. That, yep. There we go. Okay, so we got those. So we need to put you in there. We need to put these in the four corners, like so. We need to put this guy up top. And then we just need uh, the battery. 
that over here in a second. Uh, so that takes care of that. Um, and then, so to make uh, to make the ingots, the, the nickelite ingots, we're going to need a couple more pieces of iron. How many of those nickelite ingots do I need? I need four. So let's grab four pieces of iron. One, two, three, four. I should be able to hook it up to this uh, because I think this is generating, and it's generating e-power. I might be able to put it up there. I might be able to. Um, give me one more. Come on. One more and we're good. I think that the, I think this mod is I think this mod is compatible with Tech Reborn. I think I don't know for sure. Uh, so you go there, I think, and then one, two, or five. Nope. Uh, how do you make? How you make? Infuser, battery. Oh, it's two. Ha! <laughs> That's why. That's why it didn't work that and then we come up here and we put you in there like that and that gives us user right and i hook you up right yeah. hook you up right there oh you do get power <gasps> beautiful uh and then we go ahead and we do four of you and four of you and are you a fast machine or are you a slow machine you seem to be relatively slow be back in a minute okay this should be done it is uh now we're ready to make uh one of these again so we need one of you and we need some of you that yep and then we need to make uh this guy the one we need machine block I have the machine block i don't have the machine why do i not have this all right how do i make the hammer because <laughs> i'm tired of waiting on these plates I guess I forgot to make that. So hammer from this guy. So that's five pieces of iron and six. That's easy enough. Five and six. That's enough. And you and like that get that. And then just need to make you know, five, five, six. I don't know. A lot. We need to make a lot. We need to make a lot of things. Um. Trying to make the, uh, trying to make these upgrades. We got to try to make pulverizer or, or infuser. No, we made the we made the infuser. We're trying to make the. What am I trying to make? I'm trying to make the upgrade. That's what I'm trying to make. I need to make this guy. I don't need to make. We're good. Give me that. Fine. We're good. And then I can make this. The items. Sweet. All right. I don't know what I was thinking. Uh, so let's sleep the night away. We'll go back to the base or go back to the pyramid. We'll check this thing out, see what it's looking like, right? Uh, my aglets are just about broke. I do have, do have some rockets up. Yeah. Might need to make some more of those. Hello? Hi. How are you doing? Hi. Oh, where you came from, but that's fine. Uh, so we need to make some aglets. Aglets. These. Uh, I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna wait. I'm not that far away from the base. I'm gonna wait. Hopefully, we'll be able to fly. Continue. Let's see what this thing, this guy is looking like. Uh, that's full. That's full. Oh, you're, you're at full potential, but you are not, you're not doing anything. Am I doing this wrong? I might be. Let's put that. Uh oh. Oh. What happened? What I do? I did something. I did something. It's a Mark II. Still not working. Hmm. Still not doing. Still not doing the thing. That's unfortunate. Hmm. Well, I'm going to have to do some research and figure out why this is not working because you're supposed to be able to make sand using pulverizer, right? So if you go into the pulverizer through the Industrial Revolution, this cobblestone will become sand. So I'm going to have to do some research on that. And sadly, I am out of time. So thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. If you did, make sure you hit that like button. Also, don't forget to subscribe. The likes and subscriptions help out oh so immensely when it comes to those pesky YouTube search results. 
The other thing that helps out a lot is comments. So make sure you leave your comments right down here in the comment section below. We'll chat about it. And boy, oh boy, you guys have been leaving a lot of comments and I, I, I truly love it. Um, but yeah, we'll leave your comments down there. We'll chat about them. Also, don't forget to stop by our Discord server where we talk about all things life, all things gaming, and all things Minecraft. But what other? But we are out of time for today. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. Until next time, we will catch you on the flip side. We'll see you later. Bye-bye.